morning friends today topic is BAGF AGF and LGDFC KG shipping exit exam question and answer part 11 question number 201 the first responder response for an incident is listed as below find one that is not correct answer is in the machinery space the chief winner will be in charge of fighting the emergency and the first responder must evacuate the machinery space since he she may or may not have the knowledge to fight a machinery space fire this is an incorrect statement because the first responder duty is to raise the alarm and if it is a, if he can control the fire he can extinguish the fire as per your fire words f is fine you already find i is informed by raising the alarm R is respond, restrict. So you take some response, restrict the fire, and E is extinguish with a portable extinguisher at local firefighting medium. Otherwise, you cannot control, you escape, and the fire team will come and extinguish the fire. Okay, this is what we have to do. And in machinery space, the chief engineer will be in charge of fighting the emergency. Uh, in emergency team, it will be a second engineer, it will be a fire engine room, he is a direct responsible. Chief engineer will be in charge for the engine room, not for the emergency squad. The emergency squad is always second engineer and second officer will be the direct responsibility. So this sentence is incorrect. Question number 202. Fire alarm. The fire alarm on the liquefied gas tank ship is not recognized by answer shock seven short rings of bell or shifts on followed by a long ring this sentence is incorrect because not only by this it has to be followed with your direct command that your verbal should be there verbal announcement should be there followed by the verbal announcement this is missing here so this sentence is wrong question number two zero Three, stability and reactivity information on MSDS does not contain viscosity. So stability and reactivity will talk about your chemical structure, stable, unstable, and when it became reactivity, when it became reactive, when the what are the compound react with with your uh, chemical or loop, it became reactive in nature. That all will be explained in it. We can't talk about the viscosity. Question number 204. Which of the following is not a part of an arrangement in fiber optical system to accommodate fail safe ESDS system? Answer Optical cables protected with double layer of insulation. This is not a fail safe system. As per your FGSS manual, fuel gas supply system manual. Your fiber optic system or pneumatic system will be your activating ESDS system and the backup system is always the electrical system. So in uh, ship shore link there will be three uh, types of connection you can make. One is through the fiber optics, second one is by pneumatic and third one is by electric. Even some, uh, as far as I see in the ships they have the yeah, links box it has a switch which we can change to any one of the methods and the backup will be always the electrical method so electrical method of ESDS activation is a backup method so that is a backup for fiber optic system so question number 204 this optical cable with double layer protection of insulation is not a backup it's just a protection question number 205 in ESDS pneumatic link system which equipment is used to sense and monitor the air pressure in the system so that the ESDS will activate if the air pressure in the system falls below set point. Answer is pressure switch. This is done by your pressure switch. The pressure switch will check you and direct your pressure if there is a drop in pressure in your air line, pneumatic line, it directly activates the ESDS. Question number 206. The basic structure of any emergency team on a typical liquefied gas tank ship may comprise four energy groups 
under the command center with master in charge find the incorrect statement answer for a small ship vessel cadets are included into any of the emergency crew this is a wrong statement because cadets are not supposed to be in directly with any emergency group they will be in the supporting team and uh, he will be in the under the direct vigilance, vigilance of master or chief officer he cannot directly take part any duties to the emergency group this is incorrect statement okay question number 207 certain organs like dust may be severely affected with inhalation of cold vapor the answer is lungs the location of electrical equipment is often classified by zones what does zone 1 means answer flammable material is present an explosive mixture can form in normal operation uh, i already explained about zone 0 zone 1 zone 2 so this is zone 1 what precaution must be taken in the vicinity of the engine room bilges and sir should be clear of rubbish so in the engine room bilges there should not be any rubbish items it should be clear like only water any leaking water at drain of the engine room system drain should be there there should it should be clear of your oil any garbage because if you violate your mark code regulation question number 210 quantity of vapor evolved or based on the dash of the lng its composition and temperature answer is methane number as we all know that the carbon structure methane ethane propane butane ethylene ethene these are the compounds will be the uh, density of the compound will be mainly depend upon your carbon number if lighter carbon number it will be lighter in density smaller carbon number will have lighter in density methane is lighter than ethane propane is heavier than ethane propane is propane is heavier than methane like that it will be there okay so when there is a evaporation the easily evaporating compound is a one which have very less number of carbon atoms so methane will evaporate fast than your ethane and propane so methane number is very important with respect to your quantity of vapor evolved for your lng question number 211 the element stability and reactivity in a sds will contain information on answer reactivity chemical stability possibility of hazardous reaction incompatible material etc so these are the information you can find in the stability and reactivity as i said earlier reactivity stability will not talk about the viscosity so the reactivity chemical stability possibility of hazardous reaction incompatible material this is what i was telling before in this video question number 212 which are the international bodies that provides regulatory standards for electrical equipment certification answer is iec and c e n e l e c cnelic iec so what is iec iec is international electro technical commission okay so it is located in switzerland this organization that prepares and publish international standard for all electrical electronic and related technologies okay what is cinelec cinelec as the name stands stands as european committee for electro technical standardization is responsible for european standardization in the area of electrical engineering so iec is in general everywhere and cinelec is say european union region it is the standard format in the standard decision as like your iso question number 213 the vessel cargo operation manual provide the actual location for sampling point identify one error statement answer is it is not possible to verify the integrity of sampling pipe system gas that is gas sampling type system only this is incorrect statement the integrity of sampling pipe system is very important in 
the pipeline structure. We will tell about the structure of this pipe, how the how it is made, what dia, what material, everything will be given. So integrity will be identified. So this is the incorrect statement. Question number two one four for bone joint and soft part injuries. The best first aid treatment is dasmethal. Answer is ice. Ice stand for I stand for ice. C stand for compression. And E stands for elevation. So you have to follow. When there is an injury, you have to apply ice to reduce your swollen and you have to compress it with the bandage or anything you compress and you keep it in elevation position so the blood will flow towards your brain and will not be away from it okay towards that has to be maintained question number 215 safety precautions with equipment used for liquefied gas identify incorrect statement answer Sparking is not a real danger on cold cargo. Normally associated with the refrigerator liquefied gas cargo. This sentence is wrong. Ah, this compound when there is an external spark is coming into contact, it will be combustion if it is in the flammable range. And it's a cold cargo which will liberate the carbon methane very easily in the atmospheric temperature or less than its boiling point temperature. It is more dangerous. So sparking, if it is there, then it's a fire as well. So this should be avoided. So this is an incorrect statement. Question number two one six. On the liquefied gas tank ship, the following actions should be taken immediately upon a spill incident. Identify a statement that you should not agree with. Answer: Ship must wait to be informed on triggering the ESD. By the terminal. This is an incorrect statement, which I already explained in the previous video about this. Question number two one seven. The pictogram on the left signifies toxic. This is a sign shows a toxic. Guys, please read your MSDS a little bit. The questions are coming from the MSDS. How many chap? How many chapters are there? How many? Uh, what are they? And uh, they show some pictures like this. What is this toxic? This is what is this highly corrosive? This is what marine uh, against marine for marine mineral collision. All the signs you have to read. It. This question is also coming in your exit exam as well as your assessment. Question number two one eight. Handling the storage instruction in MSDS will not include answer the example picture on unsafe storage. So this also I discussed earlier in the videos, other videos. Question number two one nine. Gas carrier guidelines and regulations. Find an error statement. Answer: An accident discharge could be hazardous due to risk of collision. This is an error statement because accident discharge could be accident discharge can be a is the hazardous due to risk of collision. Not only the risk of collision, it can be like. A, If you are not maintaining the tank pressure, tank temperature, or integrity of the tank, or your pipeline, or any loading and loading operation mistake, can be accident discharge. And on uh, nowadays, all the ships hull or uh, double hull arrangement, chance of co risk of collision is very less. Collision now collision will not have such a damage, but deep collision will damage obviously. Question number two two zero. OPA 90 recommend find an incorrect statement. OPA Oil Pollution Act, which is found by United States, and this deals about any spillage of oil in the sea, and the person who is responsible for cleaning, as he has to pay the fine. It is explained over there. So OPA answer is OPA 90 regulations are in force for tankers carrying oil and gas. So this is incorrect statement because OPA 90 already speak about oil, not gas. So this is incorrect statement for question number 220. Okay, friends, if you like my video, please like. If you want to see more videos related to this marine and the exit exam, please subscribe my channel. And any doubts, any clarification, any suggestions is always welcome in comment box. Thank you.